Suzanne Capper, a 16-year-old girl, was forcibly taken from her home by six attackers who heard that her family was planning to report her missing. She was driven to a remote location where she was pushed down an embankment, doused with petrol, and set her on fire while McNeely sang, Burn Baby Burn. After being left for dead, she managed to crawl along the road for help, but died in the hospital a few days later due to her extensive burns. Capper was able to give the names of her attackers before falling into a coma. All six were arrested and charged with kidnapping, attempted murder, and later, murder. The trial lasted 22 days, and all but one of the attackers were found guilty of murder or conspiracy to cause grievous bodily harm. The sentences ranged from 12 years to life imprisonment, with minimum tariffs of 15 to 25 years. The case was described as appalling, and the attackers were said to be ordinary people who were found to be psychologically sane. 